Hey korang, saya Zon. Welcome back to my channel dan untuk video kali ini kita nak buat review dan unboxing Funko Pop paling besar yang saya ada dalam saya punya collection. So, apa tunggu lagi? Jom kita unboxing. And yeah, before we unboxing, alright, thank you for you guys yang ada tolong saya untuk cast the vote. Hari tu saya ada post dekat saya punya Instagram, uh, Uncle Zone 11 minta korang punya bantuan lah untuk decide which one I want. So if you guys ada participate uh, dalam pool yang saya buat hari tu, korang kind of already might have a idea already what's inside the box. It's quite hard decision untuk pilih sebab boats of it, pop A dengan pop B yang saya nak beli tu lah eh. So it's very nice. So I don't know which one I I want to buy so it's hard for me to decide until you guys cast the vote and it's very very close call sangat dekat dia punya undi tu memang beza tiga je eh? between this one and the other one beza tiga je apa tunggu lagi jom kita keluarkan benda ni right so before we keluarkan if you guys have the idea already what's inside tinggal kat ruang komen alright so we will see if you punya uh, tekaan tu tepat atau tidak alright so ready jom Okay, first thing seller ni yang saya beli ni saya tak beli kat retail saya tak beli kat Shadownet saya beli dekat reseller yang jual uh, this thing and ya yeah, dia tak jual mahal pun dia jual mahal ke retail juga I think maybe because dia pun tak nak kot so basically that means that this pop is not mean already, already lah saya so, memang waktu saya tengok gambar waktu saya beli pun it's not mean anymore but it's okay as long as I get it I'm fine so First reaction bila saya dapat kotak ni, I was quite happy because condition is okay. So, I was hoping dalam ni pun okay lah. And the good thing dia gunakan kotak yang tebal. So, usually dalam makan okay lah. Alright, so ha, apa dia? Oh. Okay. Right, I can see it already. So, Ready? Ready for the answer? Okay, I will... In a count of three, okay, I will show it to you guys. One, two, three. Ha. So, tepat tak dekatkan tu? Tepat eh? So, this is my first ever 10-inch Funko Pop. So, I can say that this is the biggest Funko Pop yang saya ada dalam my collection. And, yeah, the wrapping is good kotak tak kemik I'm thankful to the seller because doing such a huge favor for me right so memang hari tu dia desain kat IM The Picture which is the kotak condition is not that mean so yeah you can see the front here ada sikit kemik so I managed to get kurang sikit lah daripada dia but after uh, tengok-tengok going here and there so the condition of the pot is okay so I'm not a collector yang terlampau kisah sangat kotak as long as tak that bad, it's not that bad and then dia punya painting pops is good so I'm fine, I'm not very kiasu type of people so this is it the 10 inch Mandalorian with the child so this is this pop is so awesome eh sebab kalau korang tengok it's a chrome dia ada chrome and dia punya size besar and yeah we will unbox and you guys can see how cool it is but if you guys already have these pops in your possession, I believe you guys are 100% agree with me lah. This is, I think 2020 punya release, this is one of the best lah. 2020 banyak gila release pops yang awesome. But I can say that this is one of the best top 10 lah. I can say top 10 best 2020 Funko Pop. Not 2021 right? 2020 baru. <laughs> baru saya nak beli. Alright, so first they have a background of a planet dan just Star Wars but I'm not sure I don't remember this is from which planet but the condition of the backdrop is quite bad so you guys know planet apa ni? I uh, can't remember Tebu? Ah, no. but yeah the condition is not that good anymore maybe we can iron it later on to cantikkan dia balik Alright, so this is a bit tricky part because kita nak keluarkan pops tanpa dia punya plastik protector dia rosak 
And tanpa kita kotak Kerosakkan kotak juga at the same time So you have to be careful Keluarkan dia Alright Mandalorian With the child 10 inch pop Dengan chrome touch Whoa With the bobble head Of course So Star Wars Every Star Wars pops Have a bobble head And this is not exception for that Alright um, Okay Even though saya dah pernah tengok The first time But I haven't really pegang dia So It's quite Light So tak berat I think is Less than 2 kilo Right, and the base is very solid. With the okay, we can see the base first with the Lucas punya trademark everything and the spanko. It's very good, and I believe this is the first time uh, Star Wars punya pops and the punya logo atau punya punya base dia lain sikit. Alright, so if you guys are familiar with the Star Wars punya pops, kau orang akan perasan yang Star Wars dia ada dia punya signature base dia punya signature pet, uh, apa dia punya base pattern dia akan ada satu design dia so this time is different so dia buat flat with dia punya Star Wars logo dekat bawah dia but it's okay i think maybe because they don't want it to be have that normal standard base because if they do that the pop size akan takkan muat dalam kotak 10 inch right so is it really 10 inch pop we'll see I have a pembaris here if I uko from the base and the top, yes, it's correct. It's a 10 inch. So it's a 10 inch pop as you can see here. So Funko tak tipu. Okay. Now we will see how beautiful it is. tell you guys right 10 inch pop punya details is so awesome compared to the normal 4 inch pop because when they have 10 inch so the punya detail there is more Funko will added more additional pops uh, additional things so you tengok a few comparison right before this ada uh, some youtuber they, they beli the baby Groot alright the 4 inch and they compare with the 18 inch baby Groot and the difference is so huge colors the punya texture everything is so huge so, memang berbaloi kalau korang nak invest more into the 18 inch or into the bigger pops because the pin detail memang insanely good. And the price also, okay. The price also okay, not expensive. This Mendo 10 inch justify that Funko are getting better and better and better and dia punya design. Kau ni syangguk je lah kerja kau ni kan. Nampak pula aku. Right, this is what the bobble head. If you have a bobble head, it will keep bubble bubble so please don't put your Funko Pop bubble heads into your car because inside your car because if you put your bubble head pops inside your car memang anggok-anggok je lah kerja dia kan so memang korang nak drive pun maybe will be a bit annoyed to do that 4 inch pop compared with the 10 inch pop dia punya size difference is very huge but 4 inch still cute lah I don't have any idea yet kat mana nak letak Mando 10 inch ni sebab Besar gila. So I don't think if I put it here will be fit very nice. Maybe I will put it somewhere dekat Iron Man or maybe I put it uh, somewhere dekat Infinity Gauntlet. I'll see about that. Or maybe I just simpan je dalam kotak sampai saya ada my own main cave which I can definitely put it anywhere. Because this pop 10 inch definitely will be an eye grabber. Bila orang datang tengok, this is going to be the thing that they're going to uh, nampak first uh, because two things I believe. One is a size, it's a big size. And then the second thing is a chrome. Chrome where you can see yourself. Bentukkan rambut. That's the thing. Okay, Karang, I think this is it my per-consent for this time around. So if you guys are new to the channel, thank you for watching. And don't forget to subscribe and click the ring bell notification button so you guys don't miss the next video. So, um, 
every now and then so i upload a new video whichever when i got a new content so i will just upload the video that means one week you might get more than one video so depends lah kalau saya ada banyak benda saya nak buat saya buat je so mungkin satu hari tu dua video pun saya might upload who knows jangan lupa pergi mana-mana pakai mask sekarang dia punya fine dah 10,000 so 10,000 you can buy lots of pops so sign you duit jangan bagi dia orang ambil duit korang sebab 10,000 again you can buy lots of Funko Pop alright thank you for watching and stay awesome